you pay a home inspector hundreds of dollars. They come and inspect your house, and they include a wet inspection for free. Uh, but they forget to tell you it doesn't include the chimney. So you move into your house, and you're mowing the grass, or you're out looking at your air conditioner, and you look at your chimney and go, what's that? It's a structural repair at the chimney. And because the home inspector, I'm open to this possibility, didn't look at the chimney fully as part of the wet inspection, they missed this. Or you have a home inspector in wintertime, and they're not carefully moving snow away from the foundation walls, and they miss that, then you move in, you're unhappy. We don't have unhappy clients because we're thorough. But this isn't about me. This is about people buying houses and spending good money, hard-earned money, on people that come to their house and don't do thorough work. Demand thorough work from your home inspector. Okay, we talked about chimneys. This is the starting point for a wet inspection, whether it's a home inspector or a fireplace contractor, whoever is on, at your home inspecting this system. This is the starting point. They're going to check the distances, the clearances from the unit to wall assemblies. They'll check the distance from the front of the unit to any combustible materials like carpeting, for example. Um, it's absolutely critical that you demand that the inspector go on the roof. When they finish this, you don't want to see them sit at the kitchen table and write a report. They need to go to the roof. You're in control. You're the one buying the house or the homeowner. You need to coach that inspector. Make sure you keep your family safe by having them fully inspect every part of the system, especially the chimney. In a lot of cases, home inspectors who are wet certified, and it's usually home inspectors who do this, they come to a home on behalf of a buyer usually, and they'll do what's called an insurance inspection and present a wet inspection report. That report has fine print that excludes the chimney and burning area, but people aren't made aware of that in a lot of cases. So we come to a house at a later time and go on a roof and find a chimney is really a pile of rubble and it's completely unsafe. Homeowners and home buyers in Ontario, when they're getting a wet inspection done, they need to demand, they need to understand clearly that the inspection includes the chimney and the burning area down below because those are the parts that are most dangerous. That's where fires are going to start. Andy Christie, Safe Homes Canada. We'll see you soon.